back to your daily workout and today our daily spot is arms and busts. So grab hold your weight and let's get to it. Let's begin. First of all, stand up nice and tall and squat and down. We're gonna work the bicep muscle, the front of those arms. That's right. Focus in the front of the arms, good. Up and down. Now, for those of you that don't have weights, I don't want you to say, oh, I can't do this because I don't have those weights. Don't you worry. Go inside your cupboard and get any can out of the cupboard. And you can use those as your resistance. They weigh about a pound each. That's right. Or you could use water bottles filled up. So there's no more excuses. Good. Firm those arms. Tighten up the biceps. Great. Tighten them. Good. Two more. One and two. Now side to side. Side. Good. Press them. That's it. Really pull them up. Let me see those muscles. Good. My goal here for you is to get nice, firm, sculpted arms. That's right, not big, bulky arms. For women, we will never be able to have those big, bulky muscles. You wanna know why? Because we don't have the male hormone, testosterone, at the levels of your body. So don't you worry. This is to tone and to firm up the arms. So you have nice contours. Sexy, good. Last set. Good, now turn to the other side, go halfway up. Start here and go lift and relax. Lift like you're carrying a tray, that's it. Just lift up. This is working a different muscle group of the bicep. Inside more of the arm exercise, that's right. Right here, focusing on that muscle right there. That's it, good. We're always gonna work on the opposing muscle groups. This is the front of the arm, the biceps, Next up, we're gonna work on the back of the arm, the triceps, the area all of us women wanna target. We got two more. One, two, beautiful. Elbows come up and press and release. Press and release. Now we're targeting the back of our arms, the tricep muscle, the area all of us really need to firm and to lift. No more underarm sag, no more underarm flab. We'll firm it right up. That's right, that's the area we're targeting. Let me give you a couple tips here. First of all, make sure your elbows stay up, very high, that's it. The higher the elbows, the better the workout. Making your time more efficient, that's what we're into. Making effective, so every single one counts. That's right, good. Two more, last one. Now we hold it up, we do little touches, little touches. That's a hard one, try it though. You can do it, little touches back here. Touch, touch, almost touch the weight. Ooh, that's hard, but lift your arms higher. The higher you lift arms, the better for you. That's right, more effective. You'll see results a lot quicker. No more sagging underneath the arms. Two more, one. Two, okay, shake it out, shake it out. Beautiful, good. Okay, now we're gonna work on the shoulders. Get nice, sexy shoulders. Let's begin. Lift, release, lift, release. This also works on the chest muscles. That's right, our pectorals. Give the breast a little uplift. This will work on the muscles underneath the chest, underneath the breast. Give it more of a lift. The breast won't sag or droop. That's what we're working on. Press it. Good. Let me see the definition. Let me see the cleavage. That's it. Good. Really firm it. Good. Lift and press. Come on. Show me those muscles. That's it. Beautiful. Good. We got two more. One more. Good. And release. Turn to the side, ready for the upper back. We work the chest. Shoulders and now the upper back. No more bra overhang. Lift and release. Lift, release. You could take this slower. Slower is a lot harder. Feel as though your pinkies, your baby fingers, are lifting through the action. Lift through the baby pinkies. That lead will make you work the upper shoulders and the upper back a lot better. Lift up as high as you can. You're doing great. This one's a killer, I know. But you know what? That's the area we're targeting, the upper part of the back. 
so he won't have that bra overhang. Nothing squishing out, that's it. A nice, sexy back. So if we can wear those beautiful bathing suits, that's right. Or those backless dresses, halter tops, so your back looks beautiful, that's it. Not only do you want it to look good, but you also want a healthy back. And this is one of the best exercises. We got two more. Your stomach should be in, last one. Okay, shake it out, shake it out. Now for our overhead presses. Ready, both hands right here. Ready, lift, release, lift, release. This is for the entire upper body. That's right. This works, good. Press those weights up. Getting your body in shape is so important. Firming and toning with weights really, really works. You see the body shape a lot better. That's it. It's one of the fastest ways to reshape your body. Working out with weights. Good. Couple more, you guys. You can do it. Come on. Work those arms so we have nice, beautiful upper bodies. One of the most beautiful parts of the body are the arms. They are visible a lot of the time. Remember those tank tops that you want to wear? Now you can wear them. That's right. Two more. Come on. Give it your all. Last one. Hold. Slowly bring the arms down. Slowly, slowly, slowly. This is working all the arms. Spring it up again. Up, up, all the way. Good. Hold up and bring it down slowly. Feel the resistance, working the muscles. Back is straight, the tummy's tight. Everything is working, the chest. One more, circle up. This is a great exercise. Release it down, all the way, all the way down. Release, release, release. Okay, you did it. Place your weights right down. You never want to really stretch with those weights. That's it. Okay, the hard part's over, you did it. Working out with weights is great. And working your upper part of the body gives you more of that tapered off look. So when you work the upper part of the body, you have that nice trim slim waistline look. And that's what I'm trying for you to get. A nice balanced body instead of just straight body. This way it gives it a lot of contours and shape. And it makes your hips and waistline look smaller. You have some muscles up here. Gives that wonderful silhouette look. The look we all want. And remember, the clothes you wear is important too. Try to find clothes that really help your body spot. That's it, now stretch. Let's stretch the arm across the body. Feel that wonderful stretch in your arm and shoulder since we use those muscles. That's it. Get rid of the tension in the shoulders. Relax your neck. Oh, it feels so good. How about the other side? Hold the stretch, hold it. This is where I want you to feel it now. Just feel it. Beautiful. Now let's stretch your neck. A lot of times your neck gets a lot of tension. And all you have to do to release tension is stretch it out. And hold it. That's it. Good. You're doing great. And one last stretch. Lift your body up. Stretch your arms back. Improve that posture. Stretch the spine, something so important, giving space to every single vertebrae in your back, and release. Take a nice cleansing breath, inhale, and exhale. You did great today. Give yourself a big hand, I'm so proud of you.